Hi, this is Fabrice from ASAC. In this video I will demonstrate how Lightning works on Litecoin. So for this I will use the Litecoin Qt client in testnet mode. And our own implementation of Lightning which is called Eclair. What is really important to notice is that we are using the same Lightning node um, that we developed against Bitcoin. So it is exactly the same node, the same code. We just changed a few parameters so you can connect to uh, the Lycon clients, but otherwise it is the same node as is. So uh, we will start three nodes, uh, each one with its own uh, directory, so they can all run on the same machine without problems. Okay, so we have three running nodes, A, B, and C. So now I will connect A to B and B to C. So I, I copy B's URI and use it to open the first channel. For uh, they're not actually milli bitcoins, they're milli litecoins. For ten milli litecoins. And I will, I will copy C's URI to open a channel from B to C. Again for 10 MIDI Litecoins. So now we are on testnet, so we need to wait for our funding transactions to be confirmed before we can actually use the channel. So the first step in Lightning is create a funding transaction that is uh, that sends money to a multisig um, for both parties and wait for that transaction to be confirmed and then everything will happen off-chain. So I'll repose the video and come back when the funding transactions have been confirmed. So now all our funding transactions have confirmed and we can start using our channels. So this is A, B and C. C will request a small payment for two milli light coins and will be paid by A through B. Uh, so we can see that uh, A paid C and that B relayed the payment and took a small fee for relaying the, that, that payment. Uh, we can start again. This time, ask for three MIDI light coins. So again, A will pay C through B. And this is happening off chain. Now that our channels are confirmed, all transactions happen off chain, which is why they're very fast uh, and uh, with uh, very low fees. And uh, since everyone has money now, we can have A ask for, let's say, two mini light coins. And this time C is going to pay A through B. Okay, so we can do this a few times, and when we're happy with our balances, we can close our channels and have a final transaction published back to the Litecoin blockchain. So I'll close all our channels and now uh, we can see that a final transaction has been published to the Litecoin blockchain and now we have to wait for it to be confirmed and then our channels will be 
fully closed. So I will pause the video again and come back in a few minutes. So now uh, I'm back, our channels are closed. We can see that the closing transactions have been confirmed, so they, they soon won't be displayed anymore on our GUI. Um, and we got our money back on the Litecoin blockchain. So that's a good news. It means that Lightning is working uh, fairly well on Litecoin. And there's even better. Uh, for the demo, we used our Bitcoin Lightning node as is, without any modifications. So it's it's fairly easy to run Lightning on Litecoin. And you don't really have to trust me on this. You can just uh, grab the code and, and see for yourself. Thank you. Goodbye.